Hi guys, how you doing? Welcome back to Sim UK. Welcome back to Baking Simulator. I can't believe you're here to look at episode number two. <laughs> if you haven't seen episode number one, please go back and check that out. I basically went through the tutorial. All my first look videos are on Sim UK reviews, and all my gameplay videos like this one will be on Sim UK Ultimate Realism. So um, yes, the uh, the tutorial was pretty helpful, pretty self-explanatory. I'm already very impressed with the game. I'm hoping it continues to impress me as we play through the game. And uh, I'll be able to formulate a review off the back of these gameplay videos. Um, I've already noticed, if you listen to the music... I don't know, something about this one it makes me... In my head, it makes it sound like there are three different songs playing at the same time. Not a big fan of it. Um, but I need to sort of listen to it so that I can make a full review, as it were. Right, let's jump in and see where the game takes us. Do you want to check orders and start a new day? No, because there's something down here hovering, the H. Uh, in the folder on the ordering board, you can find orders from baking shops. At the beginning of your journey, you'll be able to accept only one of them at the start of a new day. The higher your experience, the more orders you'll be able to pick at once. Okay. Uh, left click on the folder on the ordering board to see the map and available orders. By clicking on the new order, you can check its requirements. After clicking track order, the recipe appears on the ordering board. Press left click mouse on it to check the details of the order. The whole recipe is displayed in the top right corner. I love this font they use, it's really nice. Okay, <clears throat> so I guess I want to take this order. Five breakfast buns. It's the, it looks like the five minute place again. It's the other side of, uh, it's actually the other side of the river. So that's slightly different. Um, so there's, there's no way for me to look at the ingredients I need before I make it. That's a bit of an issue. But we'll just go for it. We'll just do it. We'll just do it. We've done this once. We know what we're doing. Let's try and not cock it up. Right, 100 ml of water. Uh, 250 ml of wheat flour. 10 grams of yeast. This works really well. Oh, I've put 15 in there. Look. If I right click and it takes 5 out. That's good. That works brilliantly. Uh... Nope, that's water. Okay, we'll take 100 ml of water back out again because I'm an idiot. Milk is what I was after. Now we need 5 grams of sugar. And I think that's everything we need. So now we stir it for 20 to 35 seconds. I'm not going to bother boosting it or anything like that because... Uh, I don't see the point. Oh, I'm honesty. How did it get... If it needs 30 seconds, oh, 20 to 35 seconds. Okay. Oh, I was trying to take the uh, trying to take the bowl before I turn the machine off. That's not going to work. If we put the bread down there and we stick the bowl down there. We click on this. We have a mini game coming up. We're going to make some buns. Those are very good. That was better. Perfect. How many of these am I making? Five breakfast buns, gotcha. I'm not quite sure about this mini game. It's like I don't know how I could get it wrong. Maybe you can't get it wrong, I don't know. Right, let's uh, <clears throat> grab these breakfast buns. We've already made a bunch of these, so we know roundabout what we're doing. Oh, there's a boost button here, look, as well. Press me. I don't think so. Not right now. <laughs> I don't want to screw up my first order. I just want to keep it neat and tidy. Um, I don't know whether to move my camera. Is it kind of in the wrong place where it is? It's covering up the, uh, the measuring juggy type thing, isn't it? Right, they're done. 100%. Look at those. They look absolutely delicious. Drop all of those in there. Pop that down there. Pick this up. 
pop it down there, and then we head into town. Uh, move to city. Right, I think we're actually doing quite well there. Let me just tab out a second. It's going to move the webcam up a little bit. It's kind of still covering the map a bit there. Oh, hang on. There's way hey, road closures or something. Look at this. Yeah, road closures. All right, so they're. Uh, well, I wasn't expecting that. I'll be honest. Got to get there in five minutes and twenty-eight seconds. It's got to be enough time, surely. Vogue spots, roaring avenues. So it seems like our top speed is fifty-two miles per hour. I don't think I need to adhere to traffic lights. Unless there's a policeman around, maybe. I don't know. Right, now, I'm not sure if I need to take this one or the next one. I think it's the next one, but... In the interests of uh, exploration, we'll just stick with what we've got. Even fuel prices there. Oh, do I need to fuel up occasionally? Cool if I do. If I see a little red sort of marker indicating where I need to go. Classy venue. Oh, I'm hearing police cars. Maybe there are police. Who knows? I think you can turn right on a red light anyway, aren't you? In America. Is this based in America? I have no idea. Kind of looks like uh, an American city. It's definitely got American names. Okay, that I knew a car was going to pop in as soon as I went over that side of the road. Just bloody knew it. Got loads of time. I'm going to handbrake turn. There we go. That's how you do it. Wow. Overshot it by a mile. It does look like a DeLorean, doesn't it? Half Datsun, half DeLorean. Right. Five breakfast buns, score 100%, delay zero, 60... What? Affected by base reward. Hang on, I got $150 for three breakfast buns in the tutorial. Why have I only got 60 now? I mean, I still think that's extortionately high. Okay, right, 60 then. The music going from left to right like that is making my eyes go funny. Right, back to bakery. We are good. We are good. I think, do you know, I think my earphones are just disconnected. What the hell? Okay, back in the game, I think. That's so what? Listen to the music. It sounds to me like there's three different songs playing at the same time. It's awful, 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 awful. Right, okay, what, what's going on here? What's this thing? This is the map. Roadblock Destination Bakery. Okay, so we're going to pick up a new day uh, Right later. Let me check my ingredients. How much have we got here? We've got three kilos, just under three kilos. So everything's full at the moment. So we don't need to buy anything just yet. Let's proceed to the next day. Bronze bread. 
Okay, how do I make bronze bread? Similar situation, I suspect. Okay, so we need one kilogram of rye flour. Six hundred mil of water, hundred mil of olive oil. I've got to say, this mouse scroll thing works brilliantly. Uh, Ten grams of yeast, four grams of sugar, ten grams of salt. Mix for thirty to fifty seconds. Considering I've only played this uh, literally once, the tutorial which you hopefully saw in the first episode, um, seem to have picked it up, I think. 30 seconds I'm spinning this for. 30 seconds. Okay. 30 seconds. Give me the bowl. Give me the bowl, thank you. Um, right, so we put it on the... Oh, that's a big slab. Look at this. So I've got to turn this into two bronze bread. How do I make bronze bread? I'm guessing a round bread as opposed to a long bread or a croissant. Okay, I'm going to go with this. And this. understand what I'm doing in that in that mini game. There seems to be no challenge at all. It's like just move this here and, and it's done. I mean, maybe that's a good thing. I don't know. Too early to tell. Right, so this is the first time we made bronze bread. Um, got 8 minutes and 12 seconds to do it. Oh, I see. So that clock's up there right from now. So I've got to cook it and deliver it in that time frame. Oh, click. Now I get it. All right. Yeah, I mean, plenty of time, plenty of time. I imagine when you've got like multiple orders on, that can get quite tricky. Can you have more than one bowl? You can have more than one tray. So can you have more than one bowl? I don't know. I don't even know if that'd be helpful, to be honest. Right, exactly one minute. My God, look at those. They look so tasty. Holy carumbas. Yeah, put both in there, please. Right, just slot that there. Jump in the car. Drive around the corner and uh, drop them off. How much do you think we're going to get paid for two... <laughs> For two breads. How much are we going to get paid for two breads? A hundred bucks? One day, one day in the future, many years from now, hopefully, someone's going to be watching this and go, a hundred bucks for a loaf of bread. God, that's cheap. That's the way things are going. It's this incessant need to always make more money every year. You know, these businesses that make billions upon billions of pounds. That's not enough. They need to make more money next year. It's just greed. Outright greed. Anyway, let's not moan about that. Let's get our foot down. And that light is going to change to green before we hit it. Uh, I meant this one. Yes, there we go. Excellent. And uh, now we can just swerve to the left. It's just a step to the left, do, 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 do. and then a step to the right. Put your hands on your hips, bend your knees in time. Vogue spots roaring avenues. Okay, okay, okay. Now I have heard some police cars the last time I was out here, so it's possible. 
um, that as the game progresses we have to drive a bit more um, honestly. No audio on the car really. Oh no! No! Dead end! There's a roadblock. I just spotted that. Do you hear the police cars? Do you know what this reminds me of? Um, even though it didn't look anything like this. Just the way in which it's um, put together. Um, when I was a young lad... <clears throat> Most of you out there will probably be too young to remember this. But I had a Commodore 64, and on that Commodore 64, I had a game called Ghostbusters. And what one of the jobs you had to do was jump in the, uh, what do they call it? The wagon. If you remember in the comments, please tell me, what is the name of the wagon? Ectoplasm 1 or something. I can't remember what it's called. Um, anyway. Um, it's definitely hearing sirens then. Yeah, they um, very much like this, except instead of having a car and driving around, it was just <laughs> it was just the little mini map bit. But so yeah, it just reminds me of that so much. I wonder what happens if I crash the car. Does it matter? Does anyone care? Right, so we got 104 bucks for that this time. 50 bucks per loaf of bread. Whoa. Relationship improves. So we're now a level two baker. We've unlocked the old fashioned loafed loaf, a silver loaf, a farmer's loaf, wholemeal flour, and a plus 300 bowl capacity. I forgot to look last time what our uh, upgrade was. So this is okay. It's going pretty well so far. Going pretty well. Let's jump on here. Yes, we'll take a new day. Oh my gosh. Okay, now there's two. Uh, so does it show me the time limit? Eleven breakfast buns. Oh, and that's far away. But I'm going to try and do both. Oh, did I screw that up? I thought you had to do one and then the other. Oh, okay. There you go. See, I've learnt something already. 600 and... Six hundred and forty mils of water, 500 grams of rye flour. 300 grams of sourdough starter. Goodness for that, I didn't have any sourdough yesterday. I don't know who ordered that, it wasn't me though. Uh, wheat flour, 320. And 24 grams of salt. God, that's quite a lot of salt, that. Right. Stir for 15 to 25 seconds. Go. So, I obviously, you're supposed to click on both at the same time if you want to do both jobs. I think I could have done it. I, I, I'm fairly confident. Right, how many of these am I making? Two farmer's loaves. So, we're going to go for... Long breads, I think. I don't know. Sometimes when I try and grab them, it doesn't seem to grab for whatever reason. Whatever. Yeah, they look pretty good. I'm not sure they're... Aren't they supposed to be in tins? Are there any tins? Oh, there is a tin. What's this? Oh, bugger. Have I cocked it up? I think it's meant to be in a tin. Yeah. 
Yeah, bread pan. How do I get that? How do I get that off there? Ah, see. It's a good job I didn't do it now. What the hell's that? What the hell's that? Where did that come from? Uh, how do I get stuff back off there? Oh, no. So I have to go back a step. All right. See, this wasn't explained to me. Maybe I should have read it. Maybe I should have read the, uh, the recipe. That probably would have helped, wouldn't it? Oh, let's click on the on the wrong bit as well. Right, let's try this then. Oh, I can't pick it up. cool that you can do it this way as well. I wonder if I put it in the tray. I don't understand then. How is this going to... I think this is going to be a failure, but we'll learn from this mistake. Let's the old boost button, because I've been puffing about for a bit. I don't know if that's speeding it up or not. That might be boosting something else. That might be reducing my time. I don't know. God only knows. How am I meant to use this bread pan? Oh, was I meant to bring the bread over here? Maybe I was supposed to take it out there and put it on here. Mold station. I bet that's what it was. Uh, see, that doesn't look right, does it? made a round bread instead of a square loaf. Ah, oh, well. well. We'll take it and we'll see what happens. I'm pretty sure I've done that wrong. We'll find out in a minute. We'll find out in a minute. Alright, let's uh, get rolling. It's quite a huge loading screen, considering, no offence, how basic it is. Uh, I don't know why. Just looking at that little animation in the bottom right hand corner, there's a French stick that comes flying out of the back, spinning out the back. Right, where are we going? Over there somewhere. All right, let's... Put the pedal to the metal. Let's get out of the bus lane, though, because that's not acceptable. Quite like the driving music. Elegant corner. Thank you very much. All right, it's blocked again, look. So we're going to have to take the same detour we took last time. And I, th I think we're going to either lose reputation or... Um, in some way get financial penalty against us. This has a very old school feel about it. Also, they keep blocking off these roads, but why? Oh, I okay, care, it's, it's a car accident, that's why. Pop in. Yep. 
two cars as, as per usual. Yeah. The same every time. Stopping is actually quite difficult. Relationship improved. Oh, well, apparently that was a farmer's loaf, but it was definitely not that shape. I'm surprised I got such a high score for that. Right, so we've unlocked a triangle bun, a morning bun, a baking soda, yogurt, a rounder divider, an extra 300 bowl capacity. All right. So these are our relationships. You can see that... Um, ah, so now we've got to level three with Five Minute Bakery. We can actually call for a delay. That'll be handy when you've got two jobs on and you're only going to get to one on time. So, okay, that's pretty cool. Grandma's we didn't deliver to, so... We still have no reputation there, it seems. Proceed. So I can only do one. I can't do two. So I can still only pick one. That's interesting. I don't know what the benefit of that is. All right. Um, well, hang on. 14 breakfast buns. Further away, we're going to get less money, less XP than making three golden bread. So, I mean, why would I even take that job? It's just stupid. Okay. So, if I go like this, recipe book, here we go. I right, see, look. Ah, ah, okay. After mixing the dough, it's time to shape it into the perfect form. Uh, oh no, this is a round one. Okay. Should have read it on the last, the last thing. Wheat flour. Uh, wheat flour, let's go. God, it's a lot. One and a half kilograms. 600 ml of water. Definitely running out of stuff now. 300 ml of milk. See one grams of salt. Fifteen grams of sugar. Eighteen grams of yeast. Czechoslovakian yeast. Ten points to anyone who can remember what advert that's for. Okay. Oh, <laughs> didn't turn it on. Works a lot faster if you turn it on. Let me just move this camera again. Because I think I can get a better position. There we go. Then you can actually see what's going on a little bit. Should I centralize it? Something like that. Oh, how long has that been in there? Oh, God. I got so distracted then. I was not thinking about anything at all. So I've got to make three golden bread. Right, so these are round breads, I think. No, they're not, they're long breads. One. Two. Of course, I don't, what? Oh, I actually screwed it up. I actually did it wrong. So that, ha <laughs> ha. Now I know how you do it wrong. You get distracted and you don't pay attention. Sometimes they make they put things that look rather similar. Okay, so one of these buns is probably not. One of these buns is not like the other. Can I get all three on there? I think there's a way to pick pick up all three at the same time, isn't there? Eight minutes. Got eight minutes. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. Uh, so we had a customization. Oh, hello. What the heck is that? Okay. Uh, and 
What do I do with this? Round divider. Upgrade object. You. Purchase. Cool! No idea what that does. No idea what that does whatsoever. We're going to have to read up on that. Let's get these breads out first, and then we'll come back and have a look at this thing. So I'm guessing that's going to make the round ready bits for us and save us a bit of time. God, they look good. Don't they look good? I had no idea. I was such a good baker. I really didn't. When I bake stuff at home, it doesn't always look like that. I have to be honest. Sometimes it does. Sometimes it does not. Depends on how much uh, concentration I have on the day. Wait. I do wish this loading time was shorter. Surely they could load it into memory and make it quicker the second time round. I mean, surely. I am serious and don't call me Shirley. Right, now, this baker is much closer to us. Um, is it the same baker? Like, do they have these outlets that have multiple shops all over the town or something? Is that how it works? Is that what's we're doing here, effectively? Oh, nearly lost the back end there. Right, we get $159 for that. We're up to level... <laughs> level poor. As I tried to say Puppet's Bun at the same time as four. So we've got Puppet's Bun, which I've never heard of. Puppet's Bread, never heard of. Sesame, and an extra 300 capacity. Yes, the five-minute bakery has gone up in rank. Right, I think we're going to need some stuff here. So I think we're going to need... So I just buy... Cancel all. So if I just say order all and buy... Oh wow, yeah, excellent. It's time actually ticking by or not. Seem to be doing anything right what the hell does this thing do we've got a lever here we've got some sort of massive control deck system here you have a red tray which we can take off and put back oh my god what is this thing let's press h select the category from the top then select the entry that you want to learn more about okay machines um, what do they call it? A rounder divider. Take a red tray and place it in the machine, then put the mixed dough on it. Okay. Place the cursor on the knob on the side panel and roll the mouse wheel to choose the shape. You can choose the number of portions on the same panel. To turn on the machine, pull the lever and press it again to take out the shape buns. Semi automatic machine that divides and forms dough in squares, triangles, and squircles. So then you just put the dough straight on there and it... I see. So you can switch between circle, square, and triangle. Oh my god, it's so basic. It says you can select the amount. How? How do I select the amount? like a key it's like a uh, like a key to start it and then you press this and off it goes <clears throat> I don't know how to uh, make it do something we'll find out uh, yes let's proceed so triangle buns nine of closer and I'm curious I want to make a do I want to make a triangle bun Yes, I do. Let's do it. Let's make a triangle bun. So we need 
Oh, hey, one of these. 450 grams of rye flour. Or 50. 180 of yogurt. Hundred and eighty of olive oil. And eighteen grams of baking soda. Oh I'm I'm tempted to try something here. Let's do it with the salt. So if I take twenty grams of salt and then I change this to one gram and I take Oh, I've put sugar in. Oh, you spanner. Let's put this to five then. Yeah, oh yeah, so you can do it that way and that's much quicker. Uh, so I just need one sugar pot. Why is the sugar a different colour? I'm confused. So let's go 20 salt and then take out two grams. See, look, all the rest of them are dark green, except for the sugar, which is a light green. Why is that? Is there a different kind of sugar here? No, I don't see any. Why is it a different colour? I don't understand. Right, so it's going to take 20 to 30 seconds. The triangle buns, how many am I making? Nine. I'm making nine triangle buns. Okay. bowl back. Yeah, look at that. It went on. That's a good start. Triangle buns automatically set to nine. Good lord. So if I just grab this now. Oh, hang on. I've got to press the lever again. Oh, hang on. Can I do it whilst I've got that in my hand? Oh, it's instant. Oh, that's so cool. All right, we'll slot that in there then. How long is that going to take? 25 to 40 seconds. Well, that's pretty quick. That is pretty quick. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. It definitely speeds it up. I was just checking to see if it actually did. That's 25 seconds. Look at those. They look like samosas. Oh man, they look nice. Maybe a little overdone for my liking, but maybe that's maybe that's what they're supposed to look like. I have no idea. I've never seen a triangle bun before. Have I? Well, maybe I have. I could be lying to you all. Yeah, a triangle bun similar to. Oh, what's the name of that bread? Oh, I can't think of it. Sort of long, rectangular, rounded edges. You tend to put, like, uh, foods in it and then heat it up so it melts inside. Paninis, that's what I was trying to think of. So a triangle, the, I've had something similar to a triangle bun, which was kind of like a panini. You cut it open and it was basically a panini inside. Can I go left here? Oh, I've gone through the garage. Oh, that's a bit sneaky. Well done me for being smart. Fortuitous. Yes, we'll, we'll take the uh, chicane and break on. Perfect, score 100%, delay zero. Relationship improved, $189, 81XP. Muffin forms, today's reward, muffin forms and 300 bowl capacity. So that looks like the table that I was trying to put the bread in the tin. So um, maybe we'll be able to do that now. Okay, cool.
Well, I, I think I'm getting the hang of it, for sure. I feel like we're progressing somewhat. Proceed. Four puppets bread. That's a long way away. Ten puppet buns. I'm going to get more money for that. More XP. So let's do it. Oops. Uh, yeah, let's take that with us. Right, never made these before. Wheat flour. Two kilograms. Play out. 800 mil of water. Uh, so you can't have more than one of any one bottle, I've noticed. Twenty eight grams of salt. Twenty five, six, seven, eight. One too many. And uh, yeast. Czechoslovakian yeast. 24 grams of this. Two, four, six, eight. I don't know why I was doing that. Nearly went into the whole who do we appreciate thing there. Sugar. Uh, 20 grams of sugar. And 80 grams of sesame. Where's sesame? Sesame, sesame, sesame. There's bomb, bomb, bomb. 30 to 50 seconds in the old mixer riser. So I don't think puppet spread can be done in the new machine. I think that only does round stuff. Oh look, someone's put the board back for me. Nice. Oh look, there's a pizza flipper thing there. I wonder if I can actually use that. Let's see if I can pick it up. Is that a pick up or a ball thing? Ah, oh, it's just there for effect. What a shame. do that. I pick it up, I put it back, I pick it up, I put it back. Right, uh, I'm making four of these bad boys. What shape are they? Sort of that shape. One. Two. Three. They were not centralised, were they? Not really. Could have done so much better. like a potato that one. Oh. 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 C'est bon. C'est bon. C'est weird. Okay, right, grab a tray and go un, deux, trois, quatre. See, the more I bake, the Frencher I become. So much time to get there. It is a long way away, but I don't think it's going to be a problem. That was pretty quick. That was pretty quick. I don't know what to do with that thing. Oh, yes! They look scrummy! So I guess at some point we're going to be taking on much, much bigger uh, jobs, much uh, more complex cooks and such. So we're going to end up, say, making five loaves of bread, putting three in one box and two in another box, that kind of thing. Straight ahead. Excuse me, straight ahead and over the bridge. Okay, so now, you know, bearing in mind that I am playing this game purely um, to produce a review on the game, there are some things that I feel like not bad. There's nothing bad in this game. It's a good little game. I like it. It's fun. 
I think the driving could be a bit more involved. I think the car could go a bit faster. You could have some more screechy tyre noises. It could just be improved, that section of it. Um, I don't know if maybe in time we can buy different vehicles and expand um, that way, or maybe even possibly, you know, make the car go faster with upgrades or something along those lines. I don't know if that's part of the game or not. Um, but I'm already feeling like, you know, this was fun the first couple of times, now it's a bit, hmm. Yeah. It's not that difficult, it's not that challenging, so. There's no challenge, there's no fun. It's just monotonous, if, you know, if it's not challenging. For me, anyway, that's that's you know this is all from my perspective, um, and you may not agree with that, and that's absolutely fine. Um, but by me saying that and that not bothering you, you then know that that's not a thing to worry about in the game. That's how it works. You don't have to agree with me to find my reviews helpful, believe it or not. Strange that, isn't it? Dunkin' Donuts. No, it's not Dunkin' Donuts. Oh. War puppets bred, relationship improved, full money, everyone's happy. Right, good, good, good. We're at level seven, mum's assistant, reputation level six. Muffin on the go, cheat day muffin, cocoa cup, cocoa, eggs, and more bowl capacity. Okay. So we're, we're slowly growing, slowly. Just wondering if there's something we could do here. Let's have a look at these things. Current funds, 867.28. Oh, you can take a loan. Okay, that's unexpected. Number four. Oh, number four is customization mode. Number five is... Oh, look, I need some eggs. I might as well just order everything. I've got some eggs. Cool. Uh, what's number seven? What does seven do? Seven doesn't seem to do anything. Let's go to four. Uh, that's bit, there we are, customization, right? So if I click on this, so I have a minimalistic table. Oh, no, I don't. I bought this in the tutorial. Why don't I have it? So you can see, I was trying to see what the difference is. If you look at the bottom here, you've got six legs. The difference is that it's kind of curved up. Do you see ever so slightly different? Except, it looks exactly the same. Say what? <laughs> Select. Ah, there we go. Right, okay, so now we have... Uh, so you buy it, and then you put it in. Okay. Alright. Ah, I think they could do more with like you see these trays and stuff here instead of a tray just appearing here you can take one out put it down label it up yourself I th yeah see this is this is where i always go with games i'm like you know that let me put it this way right let me explain it to you this way if this was my restaurant or my bakery i would be annoyed that someone had left those there in a mess uh, I wouldn't stand for it. I'd pick them up and I'd put them away. I'd say, you know, put stuff away if you use it. All of this space here is wasted at the moment. Maybe in the future something will come from it. I don't know. So hang on. These cost £10 each, right? I bought one before we went out and that seems to have vanished. I feel a little bit robbed. A little bit robbed. But okay. 
we've seen. 24 breakfast buns. Let's do it. What do we need? We need the flipping uh, ingredients. It's recipe, rather, that's what we need. Right, 1.2. Uh, 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 bomb. Let's see, bomb. And that's yeast, you absolute spanner. You complete spannerizer. Take that back out. Cut down the bin because I totally cocked that up. Wheat flour. No, that is wheat flour. How did I end up with yeast? I wasn't clicking on that, was I? Spinning out a little bit. I'm not sure what happened there. That's either a bug or my brain doesn't work properly. Maybe both. Uh, yeast, 48 grams. All right. Two, four. Milk, uh, 480 grams. So we'll, we'll put 500 in. And then we'll take 20 out. Didn't work, should it? I mean, that shouldn't be possible, really. Damn me and my hardcore realism. I can't help it. I really can't. <sighs> I don't think I've ever played a game just for fun. <laughs> I can't remember it. Always got to be realistic to, to a degree. I mean, this is realistic to a degree. And it has got simulator in the name, so come on. Let's take that ability to remove milk from a mix that you've accidentally put it in. Because that doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Right. Ah, oh, that's annoying. So I've got to pick this thing up and put it on there first, and then put it down. You see the mess I made when I put the bowl down? Right, so I can only do ten. It's pretty instant. Okay, the three at the back. Oh, I'm crouch. No, that, see, that doesn't help me. How am I supposed to get these three at the back? It's an irritating game. Did I get it? No. Have I maxed out? I can't put more than nine on there. I need 24. Oh, that's quite a lot. We may struggle here. What? Why can't I put any more on? Oh, because there's a... <laughs> oh, God. Yes, put it on, put it on. It's far too complicated. My brain can't take it, it's too much. Are these done? We are done. That thing's cool. Ah, uh, right, so I can only get nine on here, so... Uh, I'll try and take the ones at the back, because they're harder to see. I didn't get any of them. Oh, I don't believe it. Right. We've got space for nine. So what's that, 18-ish? That I've got. There's a little thud when you put it on there. Just enough to let you know that you've picked it up. How long? They cook really fast these, don't they? This has definitely been the most complex build so far. Build? Bake. So far. Very much... Very much easy, but the most difficult of all the easies. Did I get them all? I did. Wunderbar, wunderbar. Why can't I put that down? Weird. It went, it mu that must be a bug, right? Because it's saying, put it there. I 
can't do it. Right, now, is there any way of knowing how many I've put in there? Does it tell me anywhere? Okay. 24, going to Grandma's. Let's do it. Right, move to city. I wonder if we're going to get to the point where we're making like hundreds of things. Like a hundred loaves of bread or a hundred uh, combination things, perhaps. Go! I'm going to make my own entertainment here. No screechy tyres. I'm going to check something in a minute and see whether or not... Um, there is any control support. Look at that whopping great big truck there blocking the road. That's a bit of a problem, isn't it? Can I just, like, take shortcuts? Can I go... Oh, I can. So can I not just... squeeze around it like that? Yeah, so... Uh... <laughs> it's not really a roadblock at all, is it? It's just, um an object to be avoided. Wow. All those earlier deliveries where I sort of went all the way around the houses. Wow, Nelly. Whew. That was close. Um, yeah, completely unnecessary. Oh, do you know what? I want to jump. Oh my god, not that one. Some jumps over there, though. Again, when you're going up a very big hill, this first car could be like really slow to get up there until you like rank up or whatever. So no, it actually slows down quicker or better. If you just let go of the throttle. Don't use the handbrake at all. Never late. I think, do you know what? I think people are going to like this game a lot. Um, but it's not going to take long before they start feeling like, oh, I've got some ideas and suggestions on how you can make the game better. I just think that's going to happen. A new workplace. Oh, okay. That could really open things up. Listen, this uh, video is like an hour long, almost exactly. So I'm going to wrap it up here and join me in the next one if you'd like to see what the upgraded um, location brings to the game. But uh, yeah, we've, uh, I think it's a candy van. So maybe we're going to get a new van as well. That would be pretty cool. All right, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Take care and goodbye now.